What is up guys, Benny Bear here with a little quick, 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 quick tech tip. So this light bar that I'm trying to mount, uh, it's been used before and uh, basically the threads were done. So I'm going to show you real quick what you can do to fix that instead of buying a whole light bar. So first off, you need to own or buy this kit right here, fix it thread. So this is for a 516 by 18 uh, bolt. Those are the thread inserts that you have to get into that. So to be able to use this, the steps are super easy and they're detailed in the back of the uh, package. You need a drill bit that is 2460, uh, sorry, excuse me, 2164 or 8.2 millimeters. Uh, once you do that, get your drill bit. You, drill, you bore out the old threads that were basically not even there anymore and you get a nice clean bore. Once you do that, the kit comes with the tap you're going to need. So you're going to start the tab and it has the tap handle. You basically, you're going to put it in here. It's kind of hard to do one handed. And there we go. So there you're going to start really, really straight, really, really slow. I'm going to start this tap. And then once you do, I'll come back and I'll show you after I have this done because I need my two hands. All right, guys, now we got the tap started. Super simple. You get your handle, you put it on there. And this is on aluminum, so it's super easy to... to uh, start and complete the, the thread tapping. You're just gonna spin it. You're gonna grab your handle. You're gonna spin. So, like I said, this is aluminum. Uh, if you feel a little uh, tension, just back out a little bit, and then continue. And then once you have it all completely tapped out, you're gonna clean the the bore and the threads and everything. And I'll come back for the next step. Okay, guys. Now once you complete the tap. You already cleaned it out a little bit. I need to do it, run it a little bit more, get the rest of that debris right there. And then once you have that, you'll have the threads for the new insert that you're gonna put in there. So it's larger than your original bolt you want to use, uh, so we can get the inserts in there. And then I have, for this light bar and the insert I'm gonna use, I have this insert right here. So you'll notice the insert has this little little uh, tab right here and this you're going to use with your handle so we're going to take the handle the same handle we used for uh, doing the the tap we're going to use that same handle and it has that little slit and that's where your insert's going to go so if I can do this one handed me and still have it on camera that'd be awesome I'm going to get a wider lens right there there you go that works okay so you're going to take your little insert Put it in there. We're gonna make sure it locks in there. Go back to the narrow lens. There we go. And then all you have to do is thread this in here. It's like a spring. So you feel it's kind of springy. You can see that. It's like a spring. So all you gotta do is just thread it all the way in as far as it'll go. This is where your same handle that you're using, the one you used to tap. So you're just gonna insert it all the way in there. Make sure it's uh, past the flat, just enough, or till it stops. The further in, the better. So there you have it. That's a pressure insert right there, and you have fresh threads for your uh, bolts that you're trying to use originally, except for in this case the 516 by 18. And there you go, the deeper you go in there, the tighter it gets, like any thread. And you'll be good to go. You don't need uh, to retap this if you don't have um, the space, the depth to, to retap, and you need more threads. This is the way to go. This gives you a whole bore full of threads that you can use for your uh, application, whatever that might be. You 
just go as, as far in as you need to. Um, there you go, guys. That's a little quick tech tip on how to fix a thread, a re-thread, or a tap a thread. Uh, in order to use your uh, light bar, if you happen to strip out the threads, these are aluminum threads that come factory, so they are easy to strip out if you go too hard on the bolts. Those new ones are steel, however, they are into an aluminum body, so uh, just keep that in mind. Uh, but there you go. Benny Bear's Garage. Quick tech tip. Have a good one.